Hello friends, Semigram doing TCGs yet again. It hurts my feelings somewhat that I'm already almost done with my Empires on the Rise Kickstarter boxes. I have hinted, flat out said, already that I will probably be needing to find a little bit more. So, that's probably coming in the not too long. But here we are, wrapping up my two cases plus two boxes. So, 14 boxes. We've gotten a pretty good slew of uh, Exalted, I think, at this point. Still three boxes to go. I think at this point I've landed seven total Exalteds. Um, well, there is a Renown. So that's a good start for pack one. The Titan Guardian, who I did not have yet, Erebus. Uh, seven Exalteds, I think two of which were second editions. Um, now, you know, plenty of renowns, slews, scads and scads of renowns. Um, whole bunch of warlords. The Elysian, we did get uh, Alistair. I was blanking on his name, but he's right up there. So I just had to take a glance up. I have some special, ooh, there's uh, our friend, the Wandering Warlock. I needed one more of him, I think. So that's good news. Okay, very nice. That was a good old pack. Three rares. Um, and just all kinds of other stuff. Got all the fractures. Got all the, you know, lower rarity. Hidden drop guys. Um, oh, that's right. That's where my head's at. I was trying to remember what my stacks had been last time. And then I figured it out. Perfect. So with all that in mind, uh, we'll see. We already had a really good first couple of boxes um, from this case. There's another Quartz Heart. That is a extra second edition Quartz Heart. So that will be probably making me a another giveaway deck for somebody. See, I really enjoy doing those. It's a lot of fun. Like, it's just sort of one of those therapeutic, random things that I like to do. Just put cards, get cards together, make decks. The sorting, the deck making, even if it's just a, you know, bulk, commoner-ish. I've been throwing rares in these two. Um, not a ton of them, but I've been throwing rares in there. Um, but even doing that and trying to make them decent, you know, uh, I talked about that a lot in the last, the last video, trying to make them decent, even if I, you know, I know they're not going to be metagame, you know, high level tournament winning kind of thing, but I at least want to make them not awful. There is our revolution card, the demon one. Need more of the angel one. Assuming, of course, I can play more than one. We'll figure that out later. It's not a critical problem. Hello. 
Abraxas the Mystic Fire Sphinx. Exalted. Ooh, that's a good splashy hit. I'll take any Exalted, but that one is epic. That art is just incredible. Love me some Sphinxes. All right, so this box is rocking. We're at about the halfway point of the box already with, you know, two of our four expected big hits already. But we also still have expect to see a sketch, which there's still one I need, one sketch foil. I have not pulled yet is the, the angel one. And then we still have one more bounty hunter for this box as well. So we still got we still got some some spiffiness to find. Along with who knows, that looks like a sketch card, but it also looks familiar. Which means it's probably not the one it is the one I need, I was wrong. That is, in fact, the one sketch foil I was lacking. So that finishes that up for me. That is fantastic news. So, so far, uh, four, four collection, collection hits, we'll call it. That is a pretty solid that's a pretty solid box, regardless of the fact that we got a pretty awesome Exalted out of it. And all right, there's a Anoscalus. I already had one of her, but that once again is a happy addition. Gets us another Warlord to potentially make more decks see I'm not gonna I'm not gonna argue with that the only thing is still having the ooh I haven't pulled this one I don't think maybe I did pull one like early box mania I feel like I did but I only I feel like I did but if I did it was only one so that is still a Solid hit for a two of warrior. It'd be awesome. I'm not expecting it at this point. It'd be awesome. I really want to see a god box or a one of one. <laughs> but I don't. I don't think that's going to be in the cards for me. At least not with this order. When I pick up some more, maybe. That said, to pick up some more, I will need to part with some of my duplicates. So I will be finding duplicates, listing those to move. If you see something you're interested in, hit me up, we can talk. So this should be a hit, I think. I think that was our last bounty hunter for box one, but this should be a renown or something. It's definitely a foil. And it is indeed a renown. That is our dark wood hood hideout. Which is my second copy of that, I believe. So that's still a, a collection hit, as I've taken to call it. So yeah, I will need to... Uh, I'll need to move some of my duplicates to be able to... Pick up some more. I mean, I'll trade for sealed products straight up, but um, if anybody has any that they want to trade for cards. That said, I will trade for sealed straight up. I will trade for singles I need still, frankly, too. That, that, that's always a consideration. Um, well, there we go. Valley of Ancestral Firestar Unified. I think copy number two of that for me. So we're still stringing together those uh, collection hits. But I want more chances at getting a 101. I want more chances of 
you know, get a God box or a golden ticket. So I want, I, I'm going to have to, and then I want to stash a box too, uh, since I've got a sealed box of everything right now. I want to take care of doing that as well. So if there's something you want, ooh, I don't think I had this. Maybe I did. It looks vaguely familiar. But Stronghold, Mortal Flame, we'll take that. So we're getting our hits early this box. By this point, I think we'd only hit one Renown in the previous box. So the excitement might be front loaded. But yeah, I'm going to have to find some more of this. This is too much fun to open with all the sketches and bounty hunters and fractures and all that jazz. I, I don't remember if I mentioned I did get all the fractures, so I'm good on that. Just... You know, uh, second editions, like super fancy, you know, 101s kind of stuff. Really just renowns, exalteds at this point that I'm still lacking. Well, there is another Mortis. I pulled one of those in the front part of this case. So that gives me another, another deck building tool. Love it. I'm going to have to, I really got to have to find people to get to play because I'm enjoying this too much just seeing the cards to not try and get it on the table too. There is my Angel Revolution card. It's my second copy of that. Glad to see it. Oh, I put commons in the wrong stack, y'all. You can't see the, the common and uncommon stacks, so you didn't know it. You couldn't warn me. All right, so we're at the halfway point of this box, and we're still, we're holding about on point for our hits, so that's not bad. I do see something shiny, though, and it looks to be a nice shine. Ooh, another exalted. We are hitting Exalteds like crazy. Irma Dexa, Black Magic, Sorceress, Exalted Warrior. I don't know. I was talking about not seeing like one of the ridiculous boxes, but having either this is going to be a ridiculous box or the last bat box is just going to be dead because... <laughs> That's already four total exalteds from five boxes at this point. So let's cross our fingers at this point for, all right, there's a second copy of the Angel Guardian. That will be a renown that is available to somebody. Because you can only play one Guardian. And of course I'll trade it and then, oh, you do need that for the Master Set. I'll find that out and then I'll be a little sad. But you know what? We can make stuff like that work. It's not the end of the world. <laughs> so that's already... That's already four the four big hits for this box. That's three renowned and an exalted. So my guess is either there is nothing left in this box and probably the case will still have renowned. The last box will. But that means either there's nothing left in this box or 
there's something ridiculous left. You know which one I'm rooting for. And I need y'all to, hey, there's a second Alero. I pulled one of those in the front half of the case. So that gives me, again, another Warlord to deck build with. I see something shiny. That looks like a fracture. Oh, no, it was a sketch. Calamity. Sometimes the sketch lines are difficult to make out from like a shatter line. I can't remember, and I'm not going to stop and check, if I've already gotten all the bounty hunters this box. I know I've gotten at least two. That is a foil, and that is not a bounty hunter. That is another renown. Visions from the Mortal Flame, which I've pulled several copies of this one now. So that's actually, I'll take that though, because that is a, that's a fifth box hit. And there's the other bounty hunter. All right, all right. So it wasn't no god box, but a very good box nonetheless. Four renowns and an exalted. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be mad at that. So going into the last box of my product, uh, as it sits right now, until I find me some more help me in that endeavor. <laughs> Trade me some stuff. Even. Because I know I'll still have some gaps. I, uh, last I looked, I think I still had... I can't remember if I... I think I still had 50 something gaps, including like second edition, like all the hidden uh, bonus stuff. I still had 50 gaps. Um, you know, 50 ish in the 50 range. Um, so I will certainly be looking for trades to fill in some of those last gaps. I will have. Doesn't look like a whole lot of exalteds to trade, though I still have a couple older ones. Uh, but I will certainly have a decent pile of renowns to trade. So yeah, head in the right direction. There's a veil, and I just realized I think I've probably been missing some veils and synergies again. I've been doing all right catching my warlords though. That pile looks right. There's a veil, there's a synergy. See, I caught those ones. That's good. Yep, I've got my separate stack of warlords, veils, and synergies uh, set aside for building stuff which revolution are we we are the titan one so i don't know if i've gotten to th past three of any of those i think i haven't gotten to three of all of them that's for sure certain um because what there's That'd be 24 and I've only opened 14. So I'll, I'll be lacking some, but it says something for the distribution um, that I do not believe. All right, there's Prometheus. That's excellent for my purposes. Um, that I think there are some that I may have gotten three of, but and I got at least one of all of them 
but I didn't. Uh... Ooh, there we go. Helios and Luna. That gets me my second one of those. So this box at the halfway point is pretty much exactly on rate. Uh, two renowns. I get the feeling all I'm going to be seeing this box is renowns. But with the way those other two boxes went, I can't be I cannot be upset about that. Not saying I'd say no to something fan super fancy. A second Elysian. That'd be awesome. Get one of those to, to trade. That would clean up most of what I'm still looking for, I would imagine. Um, but a one of one. Ooh. Or uh, a golden ticket. Any of that would be pretty neat. Hey, uh, that one, this one might be my I really like that sketch. It might be my favorite sketch, actually. And y'all know how I feel about angel art, so that's actually saying something. There's Cassia, and there is my second fought, fought on Raspy for renown number three. So again, Filling lots of gaps. We're going to bring that number of what I'm still lacking down pretty low, I think. And I think most of it's going to be second edition. Michonne. Just for the record, I'm never not going to call that card Michonne. There's a fracture for us. Hadn't seen one of those in a few boxes. We will gladly take that. Hadn't seen one in this opening for sure. Not since the, the first three boxes of this case. We got two of them there, I think, though. Oh, and there is a Shalara. So we're getting all kinds of stuff to build some decks out. It looks like, I don't think, I, I, well, no, I didn't have a full set of them after the first case, but I think this case, I think it definitely had a full set of them. So that's fun. Okie dokie. And there is an Esmeralda, Grim Necromancer. And going into the last pack, I think I am still lacking a Bounty Hunter. So that is what I'm expecting to see. Last pack of my Kickstarter order. That is definitely a Bounty Hunter. So no... No God Box. No uh, one of one, but... We got an Elysian. We got a pretty dang a good run of, I mean, four Exalteds in both cases. Um, just a ton of good renowns. Like, looking at these again. Some of these are duplicates, but some are Oh, and he's a Guardian, so that's actually a duplicate too. Awesome. That's only my second one of these, so that's excellent to fill out the Angels. Um... So that's a good pile of, that's a good pile of renowns from this opening. And then two Exalteds that are both just awesome looking. Exalted Warriors, love to see it. We got a Fracture there. It might be my favorite Fracture. I like that dragon. We got our Sketches. 
I'm sticking with what I said. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure this is my favorite sketch. Got our revolutions, our bounty hunters. All in all, two two cases and two boxes of really good stuff. I've really enjoyed this. Um, you know, Future Lore Studios, you really knocked this one out of the park. I'm gonna be looking for to pick up some more. I'm gonna be looking to trade some of this, um, turn it into more cards. So uh, thank you so much, everybody, for spending some time with me on this, too. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I have. This has been a blast. Um, and I will, I will, I will catch you all later. Also, not Legion's Realms at War at the moment. Still going to see what we can do about that. But BorderThanGames.com, the LGS that I play most of my stuff at when I get, when I get to play. Um, either use the link down there or go to BorderThanGames.com. If you go directly, you can, the link, this should set you off automatically, but if you go to, through the website, Graham TCG at checkout, 5% off your first order. Thank you for a new customer, basically, but also lets him know I sent you. So when, 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 Every, everybody's happy that way. Um, and we'll see, we'll see if we can, can get some of this uh, future Lure Studios goodness on there too, before too long. Uh, fingers crossed. We'll try. We'll keep, we'll keep at it. But thank you again so much, Lord Taylor. Y you did awesome. Uh, this is great stuff. I'll be looking for more. Um, just a ton of fun to open. Thank you all very much. Have a great rest of your day. Bye, y'all.